This is the case of Brian Young. Warning, view discretion is advised. On April 16, 2020, St. Tammany Parish Police Department responded to an unresponsive baby at a Mandeville apartment complex. Brian Young, the child's father, had told authorities that he was watching the child while the mother was working. The father said it was an accident and that the child had fell out of the swing. Police say that the baby was taken to the hospital after 5 p.m. On Thursday, after the child's mother called 911 to report that Young had told her that her baby stopped breathing while she was at work. The child was taken to the hospital where doctors discovered injuries that are consistent with child abuse. Brian later admitted to throwing the child on the ground and then striking his head on the metal bars of the swing set at their Mandeville home. On April 18, 2020, the infant was in critical condition at the hospital. The five-month-old baby was sadly passed away a day later on April 19, 2020. Brian was originally booked to second-degree cruelty to a juvenile, but that charge has been upgraded to first-degree murder. He also faces two misdemeanor and counts of possession with the intent to distribute and having controlled substance in the presence of a minor. Authorities say that they had found drugs inside the home where the infant was at. After pleading guilty to manslaughter and second-degree cruelty to a juvenile in the unaliving of his five-month-old, on Wednesday, January 4, 2023, Brian Young would be sentenced to 75 years in prison. St. Tammany Parish Coroner Charles Preston had ruled that the infant's manner of death was child abuse and blunt force trauma. And that is the case of Brian Young. If you like true crime and you like the way I tell the stories, go ahead and hit the plus button and I'll catch you in my next one. Take care, guys. I love you. Bye.